Hello, welcome to Total Body Conditioning with Shane Staley. Grab some weights if you have them, a set of heavy, medium, light, a mat, a towel, some water, modify anything you need to, and let's get going. Go Total body, open your feet a little wider than your hips, extend your arms out to the sides. Let's just warm up a little bit, circle your arms back. Start to get all the little creeps out of those shoulders, your neck, your head. Other way, circle front. Good, release your arms, give me some easy twists, right and left. Loosen up your spine. Start to deepen your breath a little bit. Big breaths in through your nose and out your mouth for 10, 9, 8, 7, Six, five, four, three, two, one. Jog it out. Just nice and easy. Get your heels up to your butt. Get those arms moving a little bit for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, Two jacks with a chest stretch. When those feet open, pull your elbows back. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Good, one more time, jog it out. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Jacks with a chest stretch. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Simple squats, just down and up, down and up. 4, 3, 2. Last one, stay in that squat. Bring your fingertips to the floor. Come all the way up, reach to the right, big stretch. Back down, touch the floor. Up to the left and down, keep it going. Right and down, left and down. Four more, four, three, two. Come back into that squat, hands off the floor, pulse it out. Right here for 10, nine, eight, good. Seven, six, Five, four, three, two, fold over your legs, hands to the floor, hips high, move around a little bit. And swing your torso to the right, slide your left leg back, take a nice long lunge. Breathe here. Today, let's reach our right arm up to the sky. Add a little twist for five, four, three, two, one. Release that right hand down. Stretch both legs straight, hop your back foot in a little bit. Fold over your front thigh. Take it back into a lunge. Setting up for eight push-ups. Step your right leg to plank, three, Two, here we go. Down, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Step your left foot between your hands. Long lunge. Reach your left arm to the sky. Add that wide twist for five, four, three, two, one, hand down. Stretch both legs straight, hop your back foot in a little. Fold over your front thigh. Take it back into a lunge. One more set of push-ups, step your left leg to plank. Three, two, one, down, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, 
downward facing dog. Lift your hips up and back. Pedal out your legs, shake out your head. Walk your hands and feet together. Last little stretch, chest expansion, reach behind you, interlace your fingers. Roll your shoulders open, feel free to move around a little bit here. Stay for five, four, five, four, three. Release your arms, shake it out. Roll all the way up to stand. Shake it out a little more, sip of water if you need it. And then we are going in two circuits. We're doing everything twice. First exercise of our first circuit, I want you to grab one dumbbell at your chest. Medium-ish on this. Big side lunge out with that left leg. And then as you come back onto your right leg, your left leg and arms will extend. So big side lunge, arms and legs extend. We're gonna go for 12 of these, yeah? Grab one dumbbell. Cradle that weight at your chest. Feet together, stepping left in three, two, let's go. Big side lunge. Now push to balance, left leg extends, arms extend. There's a lot going on. Arms and legs extend. Good, so immediately straight away, we have to use our abdominals. Pull your belly in. Try and push down into your right foot right here to help find your balance even more. Good. Nice and smooth. Lots of breath. Three more. Three. Two, one, beautiful, take a rest. If you need to set that weight down, go for it. I'll give you five. And then we're going into the other side. Four, three, two, here we go. Right leg steps out. Big side lunge, arms and leg extend. Good. So, as much as I'm extending my lifted arm and leg, I'm extending through that standing leg down into the floor just as much. Use your abdominals, use your breath. Excellent, two more right here. Lunge and balance, lunge and rest. Nice, you guys set down that weight. We have some plank rows coming up. I want you to grab two weights and bring them down. Beanie Mish may be heavy on this. Now we're gonna take 10 rows on the right, a little rest, and then 10 on the left, looks like this. Feet are wide, hips stay facing the floor. So when you take that row, try not to move your hips, keep that right hip down on this first side. Right elbow will lift up and down 10 times. Come on down, hands under your shoulders. Feet are wide, square off your hips, pull your belly in three, two, right arm. Exhale, lift and down, two, Three, four, keep that right hip facing the floor. Five, six, seven, eight, one more, and rest. Knees to the floor, short rest. We'll take that left arm, same thing. Five, hands under shoulders. Four, feet wide, three, hips square, two, left side, exhale, lift, and down, two, three, four, going to ten, five, six, 
seven, eight, nine, one more. Knees down, press back child's pose. Take a breath. I want you to move one weight out of the way and then bring one weight with you as you come onto your back. Accordion crunches. Now this weight is optional. If this weight is too much, then get rid of it. Otherwise, bring that weight to your chest. Come all the way onto your back. We have 15 accordion crunches. Inhale to prepare. Exhale, scoop your belly in. Come all the way up, bring your chest to your thighs, and then lower back down. Now option as you lower to keep those feet off the floor. All the way up, and down. Three, and down. Four, five. The closer you keep the weight to your chest, the more those abs are gonna kick in. Big exhales, you come up. Exhale. Exhale. Five more. Five. Four. Three. Two. And rest. Beautiful. Ooh, take your time, stand on up. We have some rear delt flies. We're taking both arms together, so maybe go a little lighter on this weight. You'll pitch forward, hands in line with your knees, spine super long, try not to round your upper back. Shoulder blades are squeezing. Lift both arms to the side and down. Yeah, grab your weights. One in each hand, a little bit lighter. We're going for 15 of these. I'll turn to the side so you can see my setup. Bend your knees, pitch forward, hands are knee height. Palms face each other, squeeze those shoulder blades already. Here we go. Exhale, squeeze, and down. Two, good. Four, five, six. Try and drag your weight into your heels and pull your belly in a little bit more. Five more. Use your back. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Four, three, two, one more and rest. Weights down, shake it out. All right, last thing in this first circuit, medium-ish to heavy, up to you, let me show you what we got. One weight in each hand, starting with our feet together, knees soft, open into a wide squat, and then back narrow, wide and narrow. Wide and narrow equals one, we're going for 20. Two, zero, grab some weights, this is our closer for this first round. Feet together. Three, two, one. Open wide and narrow. Now every time you land, your knees bend, bend, bend. Good. Heels stay on the floor. My belly is drawing in a lot to support my spine. Yes. Halfway, 10 more, 10, nine, eight. We're focusing on our landing, more so on this jump than getting air. Four, three, two, and rest. Beautiful, weights down, shake it out. Sip of water, towel off. That was our first round through. We're gonna cycle through all of that one more time. Take a breath. All right, little reminder of where we're starting. One weight, medium-ish, side lunge, extend 12 times. Let's grab that weight. Second round. 
of our first circuit. Five, feet together. Four, three, rock that weight. Two, left leg steps out. One, side lunge. Extend arms and leg. Good, lots of breath, lots of control, which means lots of focus. Good. Challenge yourself. Take a big step out on that lunge. Go wide. Good. Five more. Five. Four. Three. One more. Yes. Weight down if you need to. Short little rest. Five. We'll take that other side. In four. Three feet together. Two, rack that weight. One, right leg steps out. Big lunge. Push and balance. Lunge. Nice. Notice how you're breathing. Try and let your breath help you. Exhale on those hard, part, hard parts. Exhale on those hard parts. Last five. Four. Three. Two. And rest. Yes, so good. Take a breath. Plank rows are next. You know what these felt like last time. Go heavier if you want. Go lighter if you need to. You can also do this without a weight. Come on down. Let's start on the left arm this time. Left arm for 10. Hands under your shoulders. Feet wide, hips square, three, two, here we go. Left arm up and down, two. Keep that left hip facing the floor. Four more, four, three, two, Knees to the floor, short rest. Same thing, other side, right arm, last set. Five, four, feet wide. Three, shoulders over wrist. Two, here we go, right arm. 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Right hip down, five. Four, three, two, one more. Knees down, child's pose. Swish around, let it go. Move one weight out of the way. Bring that other one with you if you're using it in our accordion crunches on your back. Legs are long. Come on down if you're using that weight. Bring it to your chest. We have 15 of these. Inhale, prepare. Exhale, crunch all the way up. Up and down. Again, option to float those feet off the floor when you come down. If you can keep that weight close to your chest, you're gonna hit those abs a little harder. Halfway. Five more. Five. Four. Three. Two. And 
one. So good. Woo! Stand on up. I want you to get rid of the heavy weight and go light. I want form to be super important on this next one. Yeah, anytime you're dealing with your back, go for form over weight. We've got some rear delt flies. 15 times. Grab your weights. Feet are hip width apart or maybe a touch wider. Bend your knees. Hands are knee level, palms face each other. My back is already working here. Let's go, exhale, lift. 15, 14, go ahead. Imagine a broomstick along your spine. Get that long from tail to head. Pull your belly in. Six more. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And rest. Yes, weights down. Shake it out, tail off if you need to. Sip of water if you need it. Last exercise in this round to finish up our first circuit. Heavyish weights or medium. We got those jump squats 20 times. Here we go, you guys. Five. Feet together. Four. Three. Two. Nice and easy. One wide, one in. Toes are straight forward. I'm bringing my feet all the way together. My chest is lifted. Don't drop your head and shoulders. Good. Belly in. 10 more. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, one more, rest. So good, weights down, shake it out. Take a little longer rest. We're transitioning into circuit number two. Breathe, grab water, shake it out. Okay, moving right along. One weight on this next one. I'm gonna have you hold that weight in. Let's start with your left hand, left leg. Single leg deadlift. My right knee is gonna bend just a little bit. My spine is super long, I'm pitching forward, and then I'm coming all the way back up. I'm whoop, pitching forward and coming back up. Now, just like those rear delt flies, imagine a broomstick. Don't let your upper back and shoulders round. The goal is not to touch the floor. So if you're rounding to touch the floor, come up a little higher. Keep that integrity of your spine over depth. One weight, medium-ish, maybe heavy. It actually helps your balance a little bit to have a little weight in that hand. We're gonna go for 12 of these. Left hand holds that weight, left leg will lift. Right arm can do whatever helps you balance. Three, I'll face front, two, here we go. Now I'm keeping my left toes pointing straight down so I'm not moving my hips. My hips are staying square as I reach forward and back up. Over and up. Good. So I'm feeling this a lot in my right glute, my right hamstring. Also the back of my left leg as I lift. Three more. Three. Two. One, set your weight down. Just shake it out. Breathe. 
the more you can calm your energy, the better chance of balancing you'll have. So keep that breath slow and calm. Other side, right hand, right leg. Three, two, one. Left knee can bend just a little bit. Keep your spine long. Come all the way back up. Again. Two, going to 12. Three. I'm really pushing him to my left foot right there to help me come back up. Push into your left foot, rise. Halfway, six more. Six. Five. Four. Three, one more, rest, weight down, shake it out, nice job, towel off, grab water, okay, arms, we're going for bicep curls, but a little different today, we're going to take one forward, and then one to the side, yeah, my arms are just coming up to my shoulders to the sides. One forward, one side counts as one. We're gonna go for 10 of these. Medium-ish, maybe light. See how this first round feels. Grab your weights. Setting up, three, palms forward. Two, belly in, one. One time front to your shoulders. And then one time side, palms are still coming to my shoulders. I'm just making like a little W in my arms. Front, side, good. Front, side. Tiny, tiny bend in your knees to help scoop your belly in. Nice. Up, side, lots of control on the way down, halfway there, front, side, last four, side, good, last three, side, last two, side, last one, and rest. Nice. Shake out those arms. Okay. Back into the legs. You're going to start with your feet together. We're just going to hold one weight in our left hand to start. Left foot steps forward into a front lunge. Lots of abs to push back together. And then left leg steps back into a back lunge. So a little tick tock. Front lunge. Back lunge counts as one. We're gonna go for eight of these. Grab one weight. One weight in that left hand. We'll step our left foot forward first. Lots of abs. Three, two, here we go. Lunge front, push to close, lunge back. That's one. Front, back. Now keep your torso nice and upright. Don't let that weight in your left hand pull you over to the left. Front. Back. Front. Back. Three more. Three. Two. One more. One. Take. A rest, you can set that weight down if you'd like. Little breather and then our right leg will move. Five, four, right hand holds that weight. Three, two, here we go. Right leg lunges front, step together. Lunge back, up, front, back. Now kick in those abdominals. Don't let that weight pull you over to the right. Front, back, 
front, back, three more, three, two, one more, one, and rest. Nice, set that weight down. Shake it out and meet me on the floor. We have a set of power push-ups. Feet will start together, hands are wide. When you lower down into your push-up, I want you to open your feet, and when you push back up, close your feet. Lots of abs to keep those hips up. We're going for 12. Now, real quick, if you're taking these on your knees, don't move your legs, move your hands. Hands start together. Hands will open and then come back in. So you decide, if you're coming with me, with knees off the floor, hands are wide, feet together. Three, two, let's go for 12. Open as you lower, exhale, push and close. Down, up two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one more, knees to the floor, shake it out, when you're ready, stand on up, Woo! all right, we have some alternating lunge jumps, so we took those strength ones, lunges earlier, we're going to add a little power, right and left, 30 times. This is the last exercise in this second circuit. First round of it. Three, two, let's go. 30, 29. Good. Find your breath. Halfway, let's go. Woo! 10, yes, nine, keep that push. Six, five, four, three, two, yes. Shake it out, grab water, catch breath. Take a minute, then we'll go from the top. So good, you guys. Just one more cycle through the second circuit, and then you are done. Pushing through. You know what everything felt like. Adjust that weight as needed. We've got our single leg deadlifts. Left side coming up. Breathe. Five. Four. Twelve times. Three. Hips are square. Two. Belly in. One. Here we go. Tiny bend in that right knee. Come all the way back up. Again, two, three, four. So my gaze is out in front of me slightly. I'm not looking straight down to the floor. Good. Seven. Eight, nine, three more, ten, one more, rest, set that weight down. While you breathe, just notice your energy, try and stay calm, other side in five, last set. Four, right arm, right leg. Three, two, here we go, nice and calm. Left knee bends slightly, all the way back up to stand. Again. Good. Notice your breath. Big exhales out your mouth. Let it help you. Six more. 
Make sure your, your whole left foot is on the floor. Last three. Two. And rest. Set that weight down. Shake it out. Nice work, you guys. Switch into our arms. We have those bicep curls. One front, one side, 10 times. Get that right weight ready. And we'll start in five, four, three, palms forward, belly in, two, lots of breath, one. Exhale, curl to the side. Control the down. Up. Side. That's two going to ten. Up. Three. Good. Up. Can you keep your neck and shoulders soft? Four. Up. Five. Halfway there. Seven. Eight. Nine. You got it. Last set right here. One front, one side, and rest. Nice. Shake out your arms. Switching up, going back to the legs. So I do that often. I have a student arm exercise, and then a leg exercise. That way one can rest while the other works, and then it's ready to go right after. So left hand, left leg, front lunge, reverse lunge, eight times. Grab that weight. Lots of abs. Don't let that weight pull you over to the left. Three, two, here we go. Front lunge. Push to close, reverse lunge, one. Front lunge, reverse lunge, two. Try and smooth it out. Use your breath. Four more. Four. Three. Two. Weight down, take a rest. Nice. Shake it out. Same thing right side. Right hand, right leg, try not to pull to the right. Use those abdominals. Five, four, Three, two, here we go. Right leg forward, push to close. Back and up again. Forward, back, whoo, forward, back, four more. Four, three, good, two, one more, weight down, rest, so good. So legs get a rest, come on down, we have some power push-ups coming up. 12 times. If you're on your knees, hands together. If you're on your feet, feet together, hands wide. Going for 12. Five, four, three, two. Here we go. Open as you lower. Close as you push up. Up. Exhale. Exhale. Six more. Six, five, four, three, 
One more. Knees to the floor. Let that go. So good. We're here, you guys. Last exercise in the second circuit. Closer for that and also for our workout. Grab water, tail off. Get that last little bit of push. Ready to go. Alternating lunge jumps. Three, zero. 30 times. Ah, oh, okay. You know where you start to get a little tired. Mentally, discover that dialogue that you can tell yourself to keep yourself pushing. Yeah, a lot of that is mental. And that's a muscle to develop too, that mental muscle to keep you going. Here we go. Three, two, one, 30, 29. Lock it in. Right, find that commitment. You got it. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, keep it going. Five, four, three, two, and rest. Yes, shake it out, walk around, breathe. Well done. I want you to meet me on the floor. Take your time, no rush. Child's pose. Keep slowing down your breath. Hips to heels, arms extended. Take some sways again. Release your hips. Let that sway trickle to your torso, your neck, your head. Breathe in through your nose and out your mouth. On an inhale, pull forward to cow. So straight away on all fours, flip your sit bones high, lift your heart. Exhale, cat, tuck your tailbone, drop your head. Again, inhale, cow. This time exhale into cat, but then keep rounding and press back child's pose. Let's take that again, inhale forward to cow. Hips lift, heart forward. Exhale, cat, tuck and round. Inhale, cow. Exhale through cat, back to child's pose. Fours, and just step your right foot between your hands. Low lunge. Move your hips forward towards your front heel. Relax your neck and your head. Bring your right hand to your right thigh, lift your chest. Reach your left arm up and over to the right. Get heavier in that left knee. Try to add more reach in that right, uh, left hip flexor. And then from here, bring your left arm to the outside of your right leg. Use that little bit of leverage, push your arm into your leg. Twist and look over your right shoulder for five, four, three, two. Release, hands to the floor. And just swap out those legs. Right leg back, left leg forward. Take a few breaths here. Let your hips push forward towards your front heel. Left hand to left thigh. Lift your chest, reach your right arm up and over. Get longer through that right hip flexor. Keep your shoulders soft. Stay for five, four, three, two. Right arm to the outside of your left leg. Push your arm into your leg a little bit. Use that leverage twist and look over your left shoulder. Keep that front knee bending for five, four, three, two, one. Come back to center, hands to the floor. Step back, downward dog. Pedal out your legs. Shake out your head. Walk your hands and feet together. We got those hamstrings good on those deadlifts, so just take an extra breath here. You might wrap your arms around your legs, pull yourself in a little bit. Try and press down into your feet to lift your hips higher, lengthening the backs of your legs for five, four, three, two, and release your arms, soften your knees, slowly roll up. Shake it out. Let's take two big breaths all together. Inhale, reach your arms up. 
exhale, let it go. One more, inhale, arms up, press your palms. Exhale, take that energy with you. Awesome work, you guys.